Everybody can exit the bus. We're going to go in a nearby locker room. You guys, come on down. Just tell me where, where, and that's it. Why you need to come here? Show up like you want to fight or something like this. Send a message, hey, come here, this place, and that's it. Without security, without UFC, without nothing. Just send me a message, let me know where, and that's it. And, and with what time? Let me know, and that's it. He's going to jail. He's going to jail. Police are, police are looking. He need to go to Russia. They're, they're all being arrested. This is not what I'm So I brought, I brought another bus to take you guys back so you guys can go fucking chill at your hotel room, okay? And then, and then I'll take you, get everybody out of here. Get everybody on the bus so you guys can go home. So today was Ultimate Media Day. And Connor showed up with uh, 20 to 30 goons and uh, stormed the place. The Mac Life guys who were credentialed let them in. You know, they went down to where the buses were, where the fighters were leaving, and started to attack the buses, throwing uh, a, a, a big dolly through the window, uh, chairs, tried to throw one of those big um, barriers through the bus window, and, you know, hurt some people, hurt Michael Chiesa. Um, Rose is shaken up. I guess the dolly almost hit her in the head. And, uh, you know, the police are looking for him. They're going to arrest him and um, unless he turns himself in. Uh, his private plane is going to be grounded. His passport is no good. Um, he's in a lot of trouble. What we're focusing on now is the fights. I just left Rose's room talking to her, make sure she's OK. Her head's in the right place, and uh, I don't know. We'll, you know, we'll see over the next 24 hours what happens. Out here ringing bells and stuff. Ringing bells in the octagon. Now we're gonna ring bells in the stock exchange. Yeah, it's an honor to be here at the NYSE, uh, New York Stock Exchange, with all the champions. You know, you got Stipe, DC, Tyron Woolley, kind of surreal to be here, and I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. Breaking news right here. Wow. It's unbelievable. Max Holloway is out of the fight. Unfit to fight, they said. Uh, so what do you do? What do you do if you could beat their mega medal? I think, I mean, he wants to fight, obviously. He stepped on the scale 154. I mean, to get down the way he's got to fight. It's the only chance to get his belt. He's got to fight. He's got to fight and fight. That is so, so, 
Us Strong Island boys are known for upsets, you know that. <laughs> Nothing but respect, buddy. I love it. Look, I love the outfits. Like, thank, thanks, I love them. Nah, let's fucking go. You know, one shot. You only got one shot at this thing, so this is it. What's up? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> this is crazy. Things have changed. I just saw you in the hotel lobby crazy. a couple of hours ago, and now you are fighting Khabib in the main event. Um, talk to me about how all of this came together for you. Oh man, I I don't even know. It just happened so fast. You know, <laughs> things. Uh, I heard Max was out, and I was said, I'm in. Let's go. It's crazy, man. You never know what's in store around the corner, and, uh, you know, no risk, no reward. Al's the type of guy that's a gamer. He's going to come to fight, and I'm very, very psyched for this fight. We'll see what, what happens uh, on Saturday night. It's just crazy how things work out. I know I've put in the, the work in my lifetime. I've been through so much, and uh, this is what it's all about. Yes, Reggie now back in the octagon in the main event. Best of luck to you. Thank you so much. Thank you.